Hey everybody, welcome back to another guide video. Today we're going to be doing Lake Trout. I know it's pretty widely asked for. Uh, there are a lot of good Lake Trout guides. I know Scarecrow's got a pretty good Lake Trout video out there, so go check that out. Um, but we're just going to do a quick one here just to cover every, all of our bases here. My biggest is a gold. Um, I know where I get diamonds. I haven't had luck in the traditional diamond spots with stakes, but you know, it is what it is. Uh, they like shallow lakes, deep lakes, lakes in general. They like lakes. Um, that's because they're a lake trout. Do you see how the connection there? Yeah. Took me a while, but I got it eventually. I, well, yeah, I put two, two together. I figured it out. Um, <laughs> they're a bait and loop preference spoon, spinner, crankbait, and then I'm going to tell you a little something, something. All right. Come on. Jerk bait, tube, worm, grub. I'll tell you this. Usually, the worm works best for me. Don't know why, but the worm, jigging with the worm, tends to work best for me. I'm not 100% sure why, but it works best for me. But these are all, will all work. But uh, if these three, you know, aren't working for you, try, try jigging with the worm. That works really well for me. Now, hook size, you want diamond only. That's going to be like your maximum four-aught hook. Um... I usually use like a 2 aught, 3 aught, something like that to get golds and up. I think, I don't think you can get silvers on a 1 aught, but I can't, I don't want to say for sure. Uh, but 1 aught tends to be golds and up as well. Um, anything small like that, you're going to get silver lake trout because these guys are monsters. I would recommend a very heavy setup. You know, 34 pounds plus it's a monster fish. And you got to bring it up from a long ways down. So definitely. Definitely, 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 definitely use a heavy setup for these guys. Now, I had some diamond spots from before the big update kind of moved everything around. Like, this used to be a really good diamond lake trout spot. I haven't seen much there. Have not seen much there. I've seen more diamond lake trout pulled out of right here. I've been pulled out of monster gold right here. Um, and then the most diamond lake trout are right here. I mean, I think Scarecrow did this in his video too. And we, we were all fishing here for uh, Tackle Tuesday and just diamond after diamond lake trout got pulled out right here. So really the deeper the lake, the better for the lake trout. I mean, Sidewinder gets pulled out here. He's a lake trout. This is really deep. This buoy here in the middle, really deep. Check that out. And then up here, if you go, here's this island, basically like right here, super deep. So you can maybe check that out. I don't know if, I don't know. Is you see how these like are different colors here? This water. I wonder if this like marks the deeper spots. That'd be something to check out. I haven't actually tested that. So maybe, maybe you guys can test this out. If you fish in these areas where the it's darker, maybe is it a little bit deeper there? Cause I know like right about here is very deep. And like outside of this island, like in front of this island here, very, very deep. Uh, I pulled a lot of big golds out there. So check that out. See if that's um, see if that's even anything or if that's just the color on the map. Let me know what you guys find out on that. But those, this spot again, great for big lake trout. Seen diamonds pulled out of there. And then this spot right here, here's your outpost, Blackfoot Basin. Just cast towards the uh, weather station out in the middle right here millions it seems like millions of lake trout pulled out right there but anyway that's what i got for you if you have any questions let me know in the comments if you like the video leave a like if you want to see more guide videos subscribe to the channel otherwise i'll catch you later